Good morning. Uh, we're on our way to event. It is uh, a little after eight. We have a setup um, at eight thirty. Uh, we should be done. Shouldn't be more than an hour. Um, so some people just wanted to kind of see a setup. So uh, enjoy the video, and we'll kind of see we'll see how we set up. Hey, what's up? We're at the setup this morning. It is 8.35 a.m. Uh, we're about to set up a grass backdrop with a balloon garland and a candy cart. Uh, I'll let you know how it goes.
Oh, good. I'm happy you're like it. I love it. Alright, so there we are. We finished the backdrop. There's the photos. Uh, it took about an hour. Um, I guess that's it for the setup. Thanks for watching this video. If you want to see more videos like this, just like and subscribe, and I'll try to add as much content as I can. That was my sister uh, doing the decorating. She does not like to be filmed. Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm back from delivering that back. It was the grass backdrop, the 5x7 foot uh and the candy cart with the balloon garland uh, they rented it from 11 to 1 so a pretty short party um i'll probably go pick it up in about three hours uh pricing uh that package off the top of my head i can't remember but it was probably around the 500 dollars range uh for two hours um there's prep there's a lot of prep work that goes into it um i have one of my other family members the one you saw setting up uh she creates the balloon garden before gets all the colors does all the coordination getting everything set up um getting the happy birthday sign painted they wanted it gold we get all that stuff coordinated but um honestly it's not too much three hours and then we go pick it up and that was it and that's pretty much 500 this day uh we do it depends each day at the most events we'll do is up to like three events a day like usually on a weekend just because uh, it can be very time consuming especially with delivery setup and everything setup's about an hour but um people do more people do a lot more uh but also i work a full-time job and uh, so this is just kind of my weekends uh it's just so just something i started doing after we did my wife's baby shower and um my sister and my wife did the balloon garlands and they asked me to create the backdrop because we couldn't we didn't have any of that i think we did the circle backdrop and there was no one really around here when we did it to rent it um so i'm like well just, they showed me a picture i'm like i can make that and after we did that it came out really nice got a lot of compliments so they were uh who started posting like hey well we can do this and this and people started asking like can you do this for mine and uh, that's kind of how we got started making a couple of different backdrops and um, doing a lot of different setups it kind of just took off and I was wasn't really prepared for it um, yeah but we'll do up to three events on a weekend I think we've done uh, so a weekend pretty much we're actually in the lower end from where I'm at um, we do a lot of our sales actually through Facebook through the marketplace um, just online people messaging us uh, we send out packages and stuff that we offer honestly we decline a lot of work that's either too far for me or it's maybe on my work schedule and it's just not something that's going to work out between both of us you want to make sure it works out between uh, the person you're um, creating the backdrop for for the event and also for you if it's not worth your time or it's not worth anything you're doing don't do it don't feel like you have to take on so much extra work uh with us the business has grown we um, we turn down a lot of work if it just doesn't work out for us if their distance is too far then i'm not gonna do it <laughs> uh just i have a full-time job and um this is just extra cash for my sister and uh, my wife when they all both do together so it's a good little side hustle that uh if we really wanted to i think we could probably turn this into more of a, a full-time just with putting more effort and picking up more jobs and um, creating more backdrops and probably putting more stuff out there um it blew up faster than we thought it would and it's just been like what is it nine months yeah and uh, we started with our prices a little low because we didn't know what we were doing. Balloons cost a lot more than we thought and then prices started going up. Um, but uh, there is also competition you see um, online. There's people that will do the, like the candy cart. Um, they'll do a candy cart and deliver with delivery included uh, for like $120. And um, so we'll do the candy cart with balloons. Uh, I think with us that is, that is like $350. So it's a big price difference and um, a lot of times it's either they're not using the same quality balloons, uh, their candy cart does not look like ours, ours is custom made, uh, you don't see another one like it. Uh, came out really nice um, and also the value of your time to me it's not wor worth it, um, uh, both of us going to deliver a um, candy cart with balloons, the amount of hours you're putting in to build the garland, uh, the communication with the client, all that for $120. I'm not saying that's not a decent amount, but the amount of work, uh, you're going to end up coming out making four bucks an hour doing all the work and uh, plus you got to charge for how much are you renting the actual 
candy card out for because you bought that usually if you buy a candy card online they're maybe about 500 bucks um, I built mine for maybe I gotta say 150 bucks um, took me about a week on and off uh, maybe about four days uh, just on and off in my spare time built it had no idea that was actually for my wife's baby shower and I'm like well I'll build a candy card and uh, I like that we came out uh, it's a lot but um people will do balloon garlands and a candy card and delivery for $120 that that's just, we rent out if you want to just rent out our candy card by itself it's 125 plus a delivery you have to charge for your candy card so they'll do the whole thing for that and a lot of people I understand they're just getting started in their business um, and they want to get as many clients as they can but you got to know your value and what you're worth and the value of what you're providing and um, if it's not worth it don't do it uh, we've had plenty of people, especially people will pay more for the quality of work that you provide. So if you're not providing quality of work and you're just throwing some candy card and you're just throwing some balloons, you show up late, you're not professional, you're not answering their messages, uh, you're not staying on that, it's it's not something that someone's going to want to pay that extra price for. Uh, we've had no problems with people saying, no, that's that's what oh, to one we had one message out of like hundreds and hundreds of messages we've had we had one message they said um no thank you <laughs> that's way too high and besides that everyone's either they're uh trying to see if that works out with the date with us or they say um oh they're gonna find something else which is great with us i know a lot of people shop around and that's if they want to go the cheaper route then that's great um but we've had no problem getting business when when we actually started this um maybe more when COVID hit a little bit more over here uh, I was working two jobs in the medical field and um, they only wanted you to work one one job because of COVID so I had to let go of one so I was I was working two part times which was giving me probably 50 60 hours a week and then onto a one part time so that gave me cut me down to 25 hours a week so uh, it, it just kind of happened I'm like all right so that kind of helped supplement some income and we're doing that but now I'm um, full-time working more hours um that's one of the reasons i decided to start this channel because uh, maybe other people are starting to do this stuff and uh it's a great side hustle um you're efficient with your time and uh you're good with communicating with your customers and you have the backdrops this is definitely something you can turn into a full time one of the reasons i decided to start this channel was because i was like well maybe i'll show some of the stuff that we were doing since we're not really doing it so much no more we're kind of finishing up the stuff we have i took off the stuff from marketplace and kind of our ads and um and only if it kind of fits in with our schedule and everything then yeah we'll do it um like this one fitting with our schedule is perfect short event uh easy and um so we'll do stuff like that but i'm more kind of showing some of the side stuff that i figured out i had to figure out on my own because a lot of people in this business they're not really willing to help or give away their secrets and so um i'll start showing some of the stuff some of the backdrops how we created the circle backdrop because that was difficult um and a lot of the circle backdrops you see online are kind of have um they don't look right you see the line in between so i'll show you the, some of the stuff that i created and how we became more efficient in setting up these backdrops because um the less time the more money but um thank you for watching this and i'm working on some other videos uh neon signs um i have a beautiful candy cart that i'm almost done with i uh, can't wait to show you and so please like and subscribe so you see those videos coming out soon